Country Noise Cat. I'm full-blooded Salish from British Columbia. Uh, graduated from the Emily Carr College of Art and Design in Vancouver in 1986, and I've been living in the States ever since. Uh, I live in Santa Fe, New Mexico, and I work in uh, a lot of different mediums, a lot of different materials, a lot of different techniques, uh, from laser-cut steel to um, carved wood and uh, bronze, limited edition bronze, uh, blown glass, carved glass, kiln cast glass, uh, jewelry. My wife uh, collaborates with me. She collaborated with me on the best of show winning piece here at The Herd. And that is this marionette with um, antelope um, buckskin uh, regalia, as well as a porcupine hair roach. And uh, what else has he got? He's got a little rattle that, uh, that shakes nicely. And um, you can see some of the rest, some of my other work here as well. I've been an independent artist since about 1989-90. Uh, previous to that, I was a fine art printmaker in New York, uh, working with Tyler Graphics, you know, uh, printing uh, artists like uh, David Hockey, Robert Motherwell, and all of those. I mean, I've worked with some pretty major league artists out there, and that was kind of my start in the art world. Well, I'm constantly experimenting and looking for the new thing to do. Um, I mean, I've been making puppets for maybe 12 or 12 to 15 years, and this is kind of the, the latest piece, but also uh, this, this steel is, uh, is a very new piece that, that I made for this show. And the piece over here is another of the, uh, the new pieces that I made and brought for this show. This is carved, carved reclaimed beech wood. It came out of a barn in the Midwest, and I, I like to use reclaimed wood because it's taking something that was old growth that was cut down and turned into a barn, and then when the barn has served its purpose, they tear down the barn and we get the beams, and then uh, I, I carve those into artwork so they have a they have they live for the rest of eternity as a piece of artwork and having served a, a life as a beam in a barn as well so it kind of documents the time from the early contact to through to forever because it's a piece of art and I like that this is blown and carved glass up here kiln cast glass for the face inlaid Alaskan yellow cedar on the reclaimed beechwood Uh, we live a, 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 a life of, of art, enjoying art, traveling around. My family uh, are all dancers. My, my wife is a champion southern buckskin dancer. She makes traditional regalia, and so all the kids have, have outfits, and we travel around to the big powwows around the country, from California to Minnesota and uh, Washington, D.C., wherever they have uh, large powwows, down to Florida even. And um, the kids are all kids are all champion dancers. Uh, my son is a traditional uh, northern traditional dancer. Um, so we 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 spend a lot of time traveling, enjoying it, and spend a lot of time also making art and enjoying art. So that's what we do.